Hey everybody, I want to show you some Montessori things that I either um, found around my house, picked up from the Dollar Tree, or um, got for free, or um, from my local Salvation Army. So I'm going to go with you um, and throw, excuse me, go through and show you the things that I got. So I'll start here with this. This is the Montessori Services calendar. This was free. They also have another one called Small Hands, and it's geared more towards parents, but this has a lot more stuff in it, and they sent me both. So um, this is not the first page, but I just wanted to show you where I got the um, inspiration for a lot of these activities. Water pouring, um, more water pouring, different kinds of pouring activities, different shaped glasses. I'm having a hard time finding creamers, but little decanters. Um, I even like this cute little socky set, but some of this stuff is expensive. This one isn't so bad. The whole activity is $13 and you can buy the ones individually, but I thought surely I can find a lot of this at the dollar store. Um, so here are some things that we have in the catalog so you can get an idea. Small child size. I'm really into the, um, practical life aspects, pouring, spooning, um, things like that. So let me show you what I have. Here are things that I got either for free or I already had. This basket I got for free. It came, I also got the same place, um, this Paddington Bear plate bowl. And there's a cup somewhere too. Um, my kids have been playing with it. And then I got this. I thought they could, you know, store something in here and transfer it to something else. Then these two, um, little creamers or I think they're supposed to hold vinegar or something I got for free at a yard sale and I instantly see V for vinegar I bet this one has something on it too oh for oil ta-da see genius uh, then this this is an egg in here in here they have an egg um, crushing activity I'll take the egg out I wanted to make sure it fit um, <laughs> mahogany homemaker Ray recognize this this is the glass from the world's smallest ice cream sundae at Ed DeBevix in Chicago. And I got this whew, 12 years ago when I was a junior in high school. And I've had it all that time. And it makes a great egg holder. I actually was looking for one in the store. And then I saw this while I was looking for other things in my kid's playroom and was like, ta-da, I already have one. Um, here are some hairbrushes for my girls so that they can practice brushing their hair. Um, those came from the dollar store. This also came from the dollar store for a window cleaning exercise. I have one little set like this for my daughter, my oldest daughter somewhere, so I got this for my youngest daughter. A lot of the pouring activities showed having um, sponges nearby to clean up their own mess. So I got these sponges at the Dollar Tree. They had two packs and three packs, so I got the three packs. Also, I'm going to cut some of these for the um, handwriting without tears chalkboards, and I'll um, show you that another time. I got some two packs of little dishcloths that they can practice folding with. I got this grater. This is also something like this shown in the catalog. I got a juicer from the Dollar Tree. Um, this I got from Salvation Army. It was not half off, but I think it was like 50 cents. Yeah. So I went ahead and got this. I want to find a, a little caddy. They didn't have any at the Dollar Tree so that we can set up a window cleaning um, kit. This is a little scrubber. They also show something similar to this in the um, Montessori catalog. These I got half off. So what's this? 50 cents for these apples and pumpkins that I thought we could do some kind of um, sorting activity with from the Salvation Army. This also came from the Salvation Army. I like that it was a little bit bigger on the bottom and the top. I have the tops for the vinegar and olive, but this is my own little made mortar and pestle. So um, they, I bought this full price for a whopping 50 cents and this half off for 30 cents. And it fits so nicely in there. So that goes with the egg activity. You use... Um, a hollow egg, I guess, and smash it up and then clean it up. I need to find a broom. I mean, <laughs> a brush. 
then all these glasses were like 15 cents half um, after the half off and then this was 50 cents I might give some of these because I don't need like four of them <laughs> to my friend but I wanted to show you guys what I had found I love this cute little beaker decanter kind of thing um, just a little candle votive hold things pour things I got this glass spoon this is um, supposed to be for like decorating cakes, but you could use it in paint, you could use it in sand and get all the different textures. Something like that is also shown in the catalog. And then um, this is going to be for a friend because we already had two of these that we got from um, Pampered Chef that I spent like four bucks on and I got it for 15 cents. And then these are little spreaders. They show things like this for like $3 in the um, catalog. I had bought a pack of four that are Halloween have like a scared cat and a goblin and things like that but my kids don't really like them so when I saw this two pack well I mean there's two of them and they sort of match and they were 20 cents after the half off I said whoa totally you gotta get those and they're really sturdy and they're pretty that's why I get some of the glass stuff because it's just prettier but I don't mind having the plastic things because it's just a matter of doing the task, not necessarily how pretty it looks. <laughs> so um, when I get some more of these put together in actual like sets, I can show you a little bit more how we're using them. But I just wanted to kind of give you an idea of some things that you can find, um, you know, at your local thrift store or at the Dollar Tree or maybe even in your own home that you can use. Oh, and this little basket I got at the Salvation Army also for 79 cents. I paid full price for that. But I thought that that was a really good price because most of the baskets are going for three or four plus dollars. I think Target has right now some um, wooden trays in their dollar section for three dollars. And I may get some of those. Um, they also have some like cardboard colored ones for a dollar. But I think it's worth it to spend two more dollars and get the wooden ones. So, um, but 79 cents was this deal. It doesn't matter to me if they match or not. I think that kind of gives you an idea where you can use a different trays for different activities. So this is what I found. If you have some ideas for me, I would love it. We're new to this, but I thought that this is a great way to incorporate some um, practical life and Montessori activities into our um, school schedule. So just comment and like and let me know. Thanks. Bye.